What is it, Rasad? Haven't you found Mustafa yet? Of course I found him. Yassar and I looked everywhere for him. I found the idiot at the coast. So? He had shot Karam. What happened? But he got away, and the wound wasn't serious. Didn't they file a complaint? No, they didn't. I'm guessing that they don't want to include Mustafa in this. Mm, uh, is the thing that he got from you with him? No, evidently, Karem threw it into the sea. <sighs> now we don't have anything left. Yes, exactly. So what? What should we do? I'll take Mustafa to give a statement tomorrow. He'll give a statement against him. I hope so, Munir. But I don't really trust that man. Don't worry, Rasad. He's such a mess that'll do anything to hurt them. But still, uh, don't leave him alone. He'll give a statement, and after that, we'll go back to Istanbul. Uh-huh. Uh, Perhan, uh, Perhan wants to see Salim. I've already requested to be able to see him next week. Anyway, we'll talk when you're here, all right? Okay. Okay, see you soon. You have a great night. Uh, he says that he'll arrange to see Salim. What has Mustafa done this time? He messed with Karem, but they didn't make a complaint. I mean, everything is under control. Tomorrow, he'll go make a statement. You're hiding something from me. I can feel it. What kind of scandal would I hide from you, Perahan? For Allah's sake. For Allah's sake, do I have anything to hide? What is the meaning of this? What are your responsibility? And it's on the first page. An investigation which is open because of the raping incident has created trouble. Meltem Alagaz's bridegroom, Salim Yasaran, has been accused. Erdogan Yasaran, nephew of famous businessman Rasat Yasaran, and Salim Yasaran's cousin, and one of the retired bureaucrats, Semsi Namli's son, Viral Namli, is also accused. Please stop. Don't read any more of that. Yeah, they even put their pictures there, and the names are listed. You don't have any right to do that. Is it this easy to scandalize people? What kind of reporting is this? I'll sue them. Tell them. Yeah, and who are you serving with this? What's the point of this insolence? Oh, you have no idea. No, we won't talk. No, we'll sue you. We'll confront you, and then we'll see you in court. Yeah, I am serious that we'll be suing you. We'll deal with the ones who are responsible for this, and then you'll see what I mean. He's still trying to question me, without any fear. They'll try and call you. You won't talk to anyone. I won't talk, of course. You shouldn't turn your phone on either. Now we're in all of the papers. And soon we'll be on the television, too. We should try and prevent it, Munir. Toronto's being so damn careless. How could someone in his position be unable to hide it? Is he becoming the scapegoat now? ID's blocked. It must be reporters. No, I mean it. There is no such a thing. We're faced with an ugly conspiracy. I don't understand who is trying to do this. The target may be Mr. Assad or me. I know. But then, nobody has the right to do this to my family. Oh, we are shocked as well. We are constantly on the phone, and the press is camped at our door. Well, of course not. Nothing's covered up. I've just heard it, and I didn't put pressure on anyone. Well, they told you wrong, sir. I haven't seen anyone on this matter. I don't know, but I'm going to find out who did. I'll guess it's someone in the party. I don't know. Someone who has made it a plan to destroy us with this scandal. No, no. No, I cannot accept that. I told you not to do it. You put your father in a tough place. I only told the reporters about the news with Salim. I didn't know about the situation with my father. I guess there's someone else digging it up. You did a bad thing, Meltem, bad. It's not good at all for your dad. This is all her fault. Calm down, Toronar, calm Meltem. down. Meltem. Are you happy now? 
My candidacy is at stake from what you've done to me. What did I do, Father? You introduced us to that family. I had been telling you since the beginning. I said you should stop if you had the slightest suspicion. You went ahead with it, and you let it continue on. But how could I be sure, Dad? You made a fool of us by hiding things. That happened on the wedding day. If you had told us, we could have gotten rid of those dirt bags. I'd still be proud. Our name wouldn't be linked with theirs. It's okay, my dear. We'll sue them for a divorce today, and we'll be done with them. No, we won't. You won't sue for a divorce. If we sue them for a divorce today, it means that we accept everything that has happened. You forget all that. But, Melta, I don't want to hear a but. If this all hadn't been revealed, they could have gotten a divorce then. But now I have to deny this, or it'll be clear. It'll be obvious that I'm trying to cover it up. I don't even know how I can handle it. Don't you even care about me? I don't want to hear another word. You've kept your mouth shut for yourself, and now, now you'll do the same for me, you understand? You owe this to me, Melton. Now their dirt has been revealed. Fatima Gul and Karem's names aren't even mentioned. I'm so glad about that. And if they were mentioned, Mrs. Bayan would immediately tell us to leave their house. But that day could be coming. I put the labels on each one of them. I only prepared one jar of digestion medicine. I'll bring the rest to you tomorrow. Okay. Tell them hello. Okay, ma'am. Be careful. They break easily, okay? Munir must be really mad now. Their case must be exploding all over. Okay, okay, enough. Put it away. Stop it. It gets on my nerves. Stop it. Stop it. Come on, Mukadish. You have enough copies of that paper already. Do you see? They took the parliamentarian on their side, but it didn't do any good. Oh, dear. I wish there was someone strong behind Karem. Then none of this would have happened to us. Oh. Fatmagul, why don't you get ready now? Isn't it early now? I'm really bored. Let's leave this house. Come on and get ready. Okay. Look at me. Make sure to wear your best clothes. You have an invitation. I'll put my clothes on. Karem is doing it wrong. He'll take her with him and then she'll always want to go. But she didn't want to go. That's just a little trick. And of course she wants to go. <laughs> Thank you.